good to see you again. Nice to see you too. Summer though. How it was, was it? Uh, it was good. Not too many allergies. Where was I? I was in Macau in oh, yeah. China. Oh, I've been there. It's no, like the Vegas that's, of that's China. That's not what people usually say when I say I've been to Macau. No, you know it's the only. It's sad. It's the only place I've been in China. We did a show. We did a couple shows there. What do you think? I honestly, um, the venue was unusual great. Unusual place. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't. I, we you were didn't, in, you and were in and out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One night, two yeah. nights. I think it was a couple nights, but we yeah, were. Yeah, I was we were there for seven weeks. Oh. It was fascinating, because yeah. part of it is uh, Macau, I don't know if any of you know, it's known as kind of the Vegas of the East, and it's yeah. just off mainland China, very close to Hong Kong. Yeah. And it's an island. It's actually two islands. Yeah. Um, casinos everywhere, of course. Yeah. Parisian, the, the Eiffel Tower, they have the Londoner with Big Ben, and it's a whole thing. Yeah. And then there's an older part of the town which has tons of Portuguese influence from 400 years ago, which is really beautiful. I was like, that's really cool. That was cool. Yeah, I didn't get to do that. That was cool. The gambling yeah. part, yeah, you know, I'm not much of a... Are you, yeah, I was like, yeah, you Back in the day, I put some dollars down for the blackjack table in I'm Vegas, not. but it didn't work out well. I am, I'm a total loser. I don't even do real gambling. I just sit at the Wheel of Fortune slot machine. Because <laughs> I like I, to get the gold I, spin. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's good. it. That's I have a friend who went big on one of those. Oh my God, Years I ago, do. She won like huge. My mother got so pissed off, y'all. Because she, she? she was sitting next to me, the machine next to me, and I hit so big. I got like $1,000 and just sitting there for like two seconds. And she was like, the rich just keep getting richer. Oh, I, was like, <laughs> I was like, mom. What did you say, security? Like, yeah, I was like, I don't get know rid of this woman. I don't yeah, know she's her, yeah. me. It was. I get very lucky on them, and it's very That's exciting. Cool. Yes. Next time you go to Vegas, give me a shout. Yes. I'll meet you there. I'm telling you, I'll, you're I'll gonna get a your to the I'll gold see... spin. Yeah, yes, yeah. it's very exciting. Well, we're dedicating this whole premiere week to like good neighbors, um, and you're about to run a marathon for for one of your. Oh yeah. 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 What, tell everybody I don't know about if I'm going to run it, but yeah. I'll, I'll do it. Okay. Yeah, my But you are a runner. I, I do run, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I love running. Do you yeah. run? Oh, I did in my 20s, sir. Which yeah. was not long ago. I messed up my... Which totally, was what, like last year? Totally, I'm 42. Um, no, but I, wow. I ruined my meniscus in my left knee. Oh, so, no. Yeah, so now I walk. That's yeah. the lame excuse. Yeah. Meniscus in my <laughs> left knee. It hurt. Yeah. It hurt. Oh, and so, yeah, I know. No, I'm joking. Know. I'm joking. No, I am. I'm it's a, a baby. That's a bitch. I'm the last born of the family... For I, sure. Last, yes. I'm the last born too. Yeah, well, we're kind of babies. Babies? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you get away with yeah. murder as well? No. Not literally, but I mean. No, no. Did you not? Well, because I'm the last born, it's very dysfunctional. This could be a whole episode. Yeah, but tell I me. didn't actually live with um, most of my siblings. Ah. Like, yeah, so I was kind of an only child too. Okay. So I did all so the chores. So that's in the usual quintessential effect of being the baby of four. Didn't actually kick in for you. It did for me. So yeah. by the time. I was growing up, I think my parents were knackered tired. Yeah, oh, they don't care. Yeah, just, they're like, yeah, just, like have at it. if you survive, I've done yeah, well. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah. 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 Well, wait, so you you love country dancing? Because I, and country line <laughs> dancing, because I, I saw this picture. I don't know if I picture. love it, but I did it. Well, you did it. I did it. And I want to show the pictures. <laughs> so, no, wait, <laughs> where, this is my favorite. Look at your little baby face. Look, I grew up line dancing. I'm Texas. Damn this you, is, woman. No, you grow up I'm, like this. I thought and, we were finished with oh that as a story God, point. Oh, my God, no. It's my favorite thing I ever. I did. I earned, uh, yeah, I earned a good you, crust for one year when I was 17 or 18. I was 18. like, how old are you? You're yeah, so Yeah, I think young. I was shaving once a month at that point. Yeah. Uh, I was about 17 or 18. How and, did you get into line that? line dancing came into Ireland and was a huge craze for about... Random laugh is... <laughs> The random laugh is actually appropriate because it was the strangest thing. Yeah. Country and Western line dancing came into Ireland for about two years. Yeah. Whole country was wearing Stetsons. What? It was the weirdest thing. Yeah. And I was part of a troupe of about eight people. That we had a little van as well. And we were sponsored by CMT, Country Music Television. I had a Country Music Television bomber jacket. Oh, my that, God, I think I that's a not... world exclusive, by the way. I did not know and that. And we travelled around Ireland and we'd go into these hotel ballrooms, four or five hundred people. I had a, a well... You and had I, a Garth Brooks mic? I had a Garth Brooks oh mic. Oh my god. I was gonna say Madonna, but yeah, yeah, Garth Brooks more appropriate. Yeah, yeah. And um, yeah, I did it for a year. I, I had great fun. And it's then I so kind of was like, I'm 17, what am I doing with a Stetson and cut off Wranglers? Yeah. And, yeah. Hey, I have some pearl snaps in my closet. I it's bet okay. You do. It's okay. That's all right. No, I just loved I was like, wait, you're from Ireland. Yeah, what no, is I know. happening? Yeah, the tush push. What were some of the I love God, it. I used to love the dance. It was great. Look, it was it was really fun to teach and everyone got involved and then it's actually a nice sense of community around it for a while. Yeah. yeah. And then it died a death. I don't know, extinction. Yeah. I unfortunately learned to line dance at a very young age. They let kids in bars in Texas, so Yeah, well <laughs> yeah. what's not to It's okay. Yeah. I ended up fine. All right, let's get to a few commercials. Colette's got the mic to help us out. Go ahead, girl.
Hi, Kelly and Colin. I work at the Long Island Aquarium. And Colin, while you play the penguin, I actually work with penguins. We have 19 penguins at our aquarium, and breeding season is upon us. We're hoping to get some new chicks, and if we do, we want to name them Colin and Kelly. Go ahead. <laughs> Stay tuned. There's more with Colin and Kelly next. excited about you, sir. Lovely um, to be here. The last <laughs> time we were doing this in on in LA, LA. was a COVID. There was nobody. There was a few people. I feel like maybe there, there was screens. I think there was something. like eight chairs between people or something. Yeah, it was. It was, it was weird. Was weird anyway. Yeah, you weren't energy, weird. It was yeah. weird. I might have been weird too. I might have been weird it as happens well. on maybe occasion. It was all me. Yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> you sang. You sang actually in Crazy Heart. Uh, do, what do you remember about that experience? Do you like singing? I loved that experience. Yeah. yeah I don't. Do I like singing? I do like singing in the car and the shower and all that jazz. Um, not wouldn't be a singer. But Ryan Bingham wrote the most beautiful tune yeah. for that film, and he wrote it on an airplane. He won the Oscar for it. Yeah. For the song called The Weary Kind. Yeah. Pretty simple on the guitar. Not that I played the guitar in the film, but Ryan wrote a beautiful song, mm. and the the highs and lows within that song weren't very extreme. So I yeah. I gave it a they go. They don't have to be though. That's yeah, it's no, the it was message. lovely. It was honest. Just, yeah. It was beautiful. Yeah, it was so heartfelt. Well, Ryan's a really heartfelt, soulful cat. Yeah. Um, that film, what do I remember about it? Just being around music more than I ever had. Yeah. There was guitars everywhere. People were in the corner playing all the Makes time. Makes you feel good. Jeff, yeah, gorgeous to be around. Medicine. Yeah. Jeff yeah. was, yeah, Jeff was loving it. I think yeah. Jeff went on and released an album and, and yeah. stuff after that. I know, I was going to ask you, I was like, did you catch the bug of music? Did you ever want to go to anything musically? Or no? I mean, I think it is, I, I, I think it is the closest kind of means outside of possibly at times love making, honest to God, which human beings can, I know, silly thing to say. No. But the, the human beings can access a relationship to God if one believes no, in God. No, I think and it is a spiritual experience. Music and vibration of music and yeah. sounds of music and all that kind of stuff, whether it's classical or whether it's country, yeah. whatever it is, there's there's an elevation that can happen. There's a euphoria. A euphoria. There's a euphoria. I was going to say yeah, euphoric yeah, yeah. kind of state. So yeah. the answer is no, I never caught the book. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you were like, no. No, but I, I, I mess around a little bit at but home. But I look but at it. I just, and yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm going great with it, but no. But wait, we were we were talking about this in the break. So we're, we actually spoke about Penguin when you were Penguin on Batman the last time you were here. And you filmed the Penguin series here in New York. And um, I love that, first of all, it's now a TV show. Whose idea was that, to make it, to go, to delve more into the character? I was, I mentioned it on the set to Dylan Clark. Yeah, during mm -hmm. Batman? During, during Batman, yeah. yeah. We, we were about, I don't know, we were about four or five or six or seven weeks in or something. And I just was so in love with the makeup. And I only had five or six scenes in the Batman film, and Mike Marino had done an extraordinary job. He's the special effects makeup designer. He's he, incredible. He's a, yeah, yeah, he is. Yeah. He's brilliant. He's just, yeah. he's extraordinary. I didn't and, recognize um, you. Yeah. yeah. And it was just so, I just thought it's, it's almost like, a waste. Uh, I'm sorry, I feel like Please. it's like, if you're, I'm not on these dating apps, but I feel like it's the picture. <laughs> you're, I feel like, yeah. you know where I'm going. I yeah. feel like they put your picture and then they show up. And it's like, <laughs> no, sir, you are a liar. <laughs> I, feel like, I feel like you're online, and then that's in reality. <laughs> sorry. Uh, yeah. sorry. I don't know. I just that top picture's not the hottest moment. looking thing I've ever seen either. But it shows a better no, top that's shot. Great. Than that's great. That's um, great. No. <laughs> but yeah, Mike was so brilliant. I thought it was almost a waste to do only five or six scenes. So yeah. I, I said to Dylan, can, can we do a show? Like, let's do. And I think I mentioned HBO. Yeah. But then I, I did nothing with it, of course. I finished the job and I moved on. And then I think Matt Reeves, who created the Batman and wrote the script for the Batman, yeah. he and Dylan had a meeting with HBO, I think, and they came up with it again. It's great. So I, I, it wasn't all my idea, but I did just organically because of a love for pretty much the makeup. Yeah. And the potential all of the, the makeup. All the hard work in it. Yeah, yeah, all that. The potential that of what you could do and just give it more life, you yeah. know, So which we got to do for eight hours of television for HBO. Yeah, it's so great. We have a clip of the character all coming together. Here's Colin Farrell in The Penguin. There she is. You're playing a dangerous game with his family, huh? Oh, yeah? You think I want Sophia Falcone knocking on my door? Women like me, we've got enough targets in our backs. I'm telling you, I know what I'm doing. You see me through twice, and I always come out the other side better than before. Trust me. Ain't nothing about Sophia Falcone I can't handle. I'm laughing at Colin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah.
you can see new episodes. I gotta tell you what we were laughing about. I, I literally, I was watching, I'm like, God, what is it like when people are whisper acting like your breath? Like, what is that like? And he was like, man, it's funny because sometimes actors don't like each other and they'll eat like tuna fish. <laughs> yeah. And I'm like, that's yeah. horribly funny. Uh, <laughs> Oh. Tail disappears into the mouth and action. Oh, oh my God! That's... No, but most people will pop a pop a like uh, a mint and I'll Because I'm like, that's yeah, real yeah, close, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, people, that's all yeah. I'm thinking about. I don't even know if I heard words. I was just like, hot <laughs> breath. Oh my God. <laughs> um, okay, and on that note, you can see new episodes of The Penguin every Sunday on Max.